tonight on Explore Acrylics. Quick tips with Mark. <laughs> so it's, it's coming into spring here in Australia and I have just realized just how much that transition of the seasons sort of impacts my paintings and the way that I paint. Um, and I mention this for a reason because there might be some strategies in there that are, are useful. I find that as it warms up and, and the colors get brighter, so my paintings tend to get bigger and I tend to get more expressive and the colors seem to brighten as well. Um, the other thing though that I've noticed is that in winter I tend to contract, which means that, you know, I end up letting my studio turn into a pigsty and there's scraps of stuff everywhere. So I collect all the pieces of watercolor paper that are left over, things like that, and tape them out on board and do little um, studies on them. And I do that with watercolor paper, pieces of ply, canvas, all the bits and pieces that are left over. Um, and it really kind of facilitates that move into a, uh, a more expressive um, way of painting because then I can rip out all of these little studies on the these little scraps here and most of them never end up being big paintings but it's kind of part of that evolution of um, allowing your excitement to pull you from the small painting into the big painting and yeah so there's this sort of little funny little evolution that goes on or a little process that goes on as the, se as the seasons unfold and I just thought I just stood in front of a canvas. 